What is up guys, boy Tony, back again, you already know it, and if you ain't know it, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel guys, so today we're going to be talking about, I know we already talked about last minute rentals, so this is going to be kind of a little, a little bit related to the last minute rentals, but you get what you pay for, that's going to be the title for this vid uh, video, yeah, you get what you pay for okay now I'm getting tired of people calling me at last minute and I hear this all the time I hear it all the time guys and I wish the customer could just stop being cheap because like I said you get what you pay for guys yeah my price is a little bit on the upper you know upper scale but you it's guaranteed that we're gonna deliver your bouncer guarantee that you're gonna have a clean bouncer guaranteed service now that's why this title is gonna be you get what you pay for I always hear the customer they always come in last minute hey uh, I know this is last minute but uh, do you have a bouncer for tomorrow or for today they always call me <laughs> do I have a bouncer they always come in last minute and they always tell me the, 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 the same story. I always hear the same story that the guy that they booked, they canceled them or they just disappeared or never showed up. And I'm like, that's why I wish the customer would just stop being cheap, okay? Because cheap is never good. Comes with bad, bad everything is gonna come with no show up, or sometimes that are just gonna scam you, whatever. So stop being cheap, okay? You gotta understand. Look, the reason we charge these prices is because it's a lot of stuff behind it. We have to clean the bouncers, we have to pay employees to pick up the bouncers, to roll, to, uh, maintenance, all of that. So it's a lot of work. We don't just inflate the bouncer and drop it off. I wish it was that easy. A lot of people think that it's all about inflating bouncer, like if we're doing balloons or something, but it's not. It's, it's, it's a lot to it. It's a lot to it. It's a lot of work. So, you get what you pay for. Alright? So, yeah. I hear it all the time, guys. I hear it all the time. So, yeah. You get what you pay for. So, that's about it, guys. I, I guess that's just a short video. Um... Um, I don't know why people do that, guys. It makes 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 the industry look bad too, though. It makes the inter industry look bad because with all these people getting scammed or or these people that you know supposedly do bouncers and never show up, so it makes everybody. It, it just it just people don't trust nowadays other people. Or how should I say this? Um, it just makes it harder you know it makes it harder because now that people you know have bad experience with another another company or business or maybe a hustler because they're not really a business they're really just hustling so just being cheap ain't good guys I, I'm, I'm just really just I'm, I'm just gonna stay, tell you straight up being cheap is not good all right so that's about it guys thanks for watching i'm gonna go ahead and place my order so let's stay healthy and uh let's get get it i'm out